All right, Mr. C. Well, uh, I shot this video for you yesterday because uh, I know you're looking for a place to put some money down here in Ambergris Key. Uh, I know you want oceanfront. Must have its own pier, uh, nice size yard. Uh, this house here is seven miles north of San Pedro Town. It's a beautiful lot. Um, as you can see here in the video, overlooks the reef. The reef is fairly close in this part of the island. Does have this pier. It's a 150 foot pier and a pier permit. See them got a little palapa there at the end of the pier, so that's kind of nice. Go out there and relax in the shade, and and uh, just a great spot to hang out. Now, as I took video of the land, I wanted to show you that uh, the land itself has been elevated quite a bit um, compared to the surrounding lots in this area. Uh, the builder of this house and the owner of the property elevated the land several feet above sea level, so it's a nice high land. You never have any problem with flooding here. It's got a nice infinity pool. And then uh, this main house really consists of two units, an upper unit, which I'm highlighting now in the video, and then also a lower unit. Upper unit is 2,000 square feet, lower unit is 1,200 square feet. And they're separate, so you can live in one, rent out the other, rent out both. You have a lot of options uh, with this property. So what I like about it is, uh, is it's got very mature landscaping. You see it's got nice uh, quality palm trees uh, in the yard, um, a lot of good low maintenance grass. And also one thing I thought you'd really like about this property, it says it's got a huge uh, 25, 20 by 40 foot concrete garage. Um, so you can store all of your toys in there and, and all of your uh, tools. So got a little interior shot here of the garage. And you can see those are full size kayaks and this is just a, a huge storage space. Now, right in the back side of this uh, garage is the caretaker's unit. So I wanted to show you the caretaker's unit. It's going to look a little rough from the outside just because it's been boarded up since April. The owner just got in yesterday. But to this owner's unit, or caretaker's unit is actually really nice. It's um, Right now it's been used as a bodega for the past three years, so it's just got a lot of stuff in it. But uh, when you look at the bones, it's got nice tile floor, all concrete construction. Uh, full-size kitchen. It's a one-bedroom. It's got a nice bathroom in it and uh, all of the ceilings in this unit are made from uh, natural Belizean hardwoods. It's really the nicest caretaker's unit I've ever seen uh, on Ambergris Key. It even has AC. Um, one of the few caretaker's units to have AC that I've seen. So a nice spot. Now the yard itself is, is extremely large uh, for this area. It's got 100 feet of beachfront by 470 feet deep so it goes back quite a ways. In addition to that, you have a 60 foot of beach reserve. So you have a, a very deep lot. Now we're going into the uh, the guest suite now. The guest suite is 1,200 square feet. You can see it's got a nice large open living area here. And it's got beautiful views out these windows straight out of the reef. Hopefully the, uh, yeah, the video camera does pick it up. So look at that. Now this is from the guest suite, not even the main house. Like I said, this is 1,200 square feet of living all tile floors, a lot of Belizean hardwood accents in here, the ceilings, the uh, uh, kitchen cabinets, the chairs, the doors, everything is made from a combination of mahogany, birchwood, rosewood, uh, zercote, just beautiful. It's got its own laundry facility here, laundry room, and a bathroom, and uh, it also has its own AC. Look at those hardwood ceilings, and that's just beautiful, isn't it? Just gorgeous. So then now coming out um, to the left here, we have some of the uh, equipment for the house, the pool pump, the pump for the uh, very large rainwater cisterns. There's several that this house has incorporated into it, uh, both as part of the main house and, uh, and the guest house in the back. Now, now I'm inside the, uh, the main living area of the upper house, the main, the main house. It's got 2,000 square feet of inside living. You see how massive it is. This is a, a great large open living area. All these windows uh, overlook the reef, see out to the ocean. It's got a big, beautiful modern kitchen, stainless steel appliances. If you look straight here, we have a, a guest bath. This uh, house actually has two bedrooms and three baths on this level. So this is a guest bath. And then on these sides are uh, two bedroom suites. So like, there's really two masters here, two master suites. We have a master bedroom on this side with ceiling fans and a walk-in bathroom. Very nice large walk-in bathrooms. Glass block showers. 
A lot of natural light coming in the house because of the way it's designed. And then uh, each each bedroom has its own AC, as does the living area. Look at these hand carved doors. Those are just beautiful hand carved doors here in Belize. All right, I think I shoot. Yeah, I do shoot the kitchen a little bit here. All stainless steel appliances, Belize and hardwood um, cupboards, Belize and hardwood countertop here. Everything stays in the house. Everything you see here goes with it. Comes completely furnished. These these floors are actually all marble. So it's got marble floors inside the house and all in the outside deck areas. And then here is the other suite uh, on the uh, what would be the north side. So again, large large bedroom with its own attached bath, glass block shower. All right. So the property is seven and a half miles north of town. Here's a little aerial shot of it. You can see the property there outlined in red. And uh, if you like it, uh, let me know, and uh, we can go from there. All right, thanks a lot. This is Dennis K. for Remax Island Real Estate here in Sunny Belize.